to you. These are the voyages of the Starship Enterprise. All right, these obviously aren't the voyages of the Starship Enterprise because this is Star Trek Deep Space Nine. And I will say that I know nothing about Star Trek Deep Space Nine. Um, I know very little about Star Trek, was never really a, a fan. I'm not really knocking it, but just not something, not really my cup of tea. This is the 1993 Galoob Micro Machines. I guess part of the space series, as were these little guys down here that I opened in a previous episode. Uh, the Star Trek Deep Space Nine. So you have the Cardassian Galore warship, the Space Station Deep Space Nine, and a runabout. So there's the Cardassian ship. And again, I don't really know anything about this. I'm not really a Star Trek kind of guy. I just remember Next Generation was like always on TV, and I just remember seeing Patrick Stewart and. Whoopi Goldberg, um, and the guy, uh, uh, the guy from Reading Rainbow, and the guy, the brown guy with kind of the head, you know what I'm talking about. But Deep Space Nine is some of those I know nothing about. Again, not really something I'm into, so. Um, so here are these guys, they're kind of falling out everywhere. They have special display stands inside. So I guess this is the Kardashian ship. Which way is the front? Is it the front? I would think that's the front. And it's got like a big old honk done on the back to fight off paparazzi and ex-lovers and things like that. Uh, the Deep Space Nine ship looks like a, kind of a big disc. That's kind of cool looking. And here's your the runabout. I guess you got a runabout. the town and get some groceries and, and things like that to feed your space your space friends. So let's bust open this er, these stands. These are special display stands. These aren't just your ordinary run-of-the-mill display stands. These are special. It's kind of hard to open. So, up oh, there, one just popping out. So yeah, these guys have been in prison for 25 years. They've been waiting to I want to fight some Klingons or something, whatever Star Trek people do. Or Tribbles. That's like really the extent of what I know about Star Trek. Um, Khan, the Wrath of Khan. So let's see here. Oh, okay, so they kind of... Pops on there like that. Okay, okay. Let's see, that's not that's not too bad. Yeah, those are kind of cool display stands. Yeah. So there's the runabout. There's the Deep Space Nine headquarters. And here we got the Kardashian ship. Uh, so that's seen in the episode The Emissary. It's a ga Galor class. They have compressor beams. It's unknown how fast it goes. The space station Deep Space Nine is in all of the episodes. It has phantom torpedoes. It was built by the Kardashians. And it's in the Bajor sector next to the only known stable wormhole. So that's interesting. And this was also seen in the episode The Emissary. Uh, it's got standard phasers, micro torpedoes, and you go warp four. So pretty fast. Faster than that shuttlecraft that can only go warp 2. But the Borg ship can go warp 9.9. .9, so that's pretty pretty darn fast. The Faster than the USS Enterprise. 9.6. And the uh, older one can go warp 8. Hmm, interesting. I'm learning, learning a lot of new things here. There's the Romulan Warbird. The Klingon Bird of Prey. USS Excelsior. I guess that's from the movies. Interesting, interesting. So, anywho, this is the 1992 Galoob Micro Machines Space Deep, or what is it called? Star Trek Deep Space Nine. Sorry, I lost my train of thought. So, we can have some little the moon 
lander, we got a moon rover, we got a space capsule here, we got some kind of NASA test plane that they can all have a big battle and fight, fight some Klingons. So thanks for watching and live long and prosper.